mad at us because we took forever. Yeah. Annoyed. Yeah. Talking crap. <laughs> yeah, we were moving a little slow this morning, but we're all packed up. We're gonna slide pack the first 13 miles, get our packs dropped, and then hike forward to a shelter. We'll do 17 miles today. It's 8.30. And uh, looks like it might rain, but that's every day, so uh, yeah, that's what's happening. Oh, back on trail. First climb of the day is called Old Blue, and it's gonna be a big freaking climb. I don't know how many feet, but uh, yeah, so back to climbing. Uh, Hopper said that this 13 mile section takes it people anywhere from six to eight hours. So let's use my Sherpa. So uh, I'm just carrying my phone and my GoPro. Let's get it. Oh, are oh, you still carrying <laughs> Well, not in them banger. Nice. Okay, yeah. I know I was looking at airports last night. I think I might fly out of banger. It's the closest one. Yeah. It just sucks because I had to wait so long to book it. So now I don't think she's going to be able to use my free tickets because it's got a guarantee more than. Made up all blue. We had a safety meeting. And now we're going to. Safety meeting? Yeah. Who? All of us. And uh, made some plans for the next few days. Now we're going to keep hiking. Uh, we have a couple things. Um, I just ground scored these cashews that I gifted to Popeye, but not really because he rusty. just smacked them out of my hand and oh, took them. Rusty. I'm rusty um, <laughs> and now we are going to dedicate this part of the video to Mama Popeye and Papa Popeye and Sawyer. We miss you guys very, very much. And uh, we know you're having really a lot of fun in Acadia, but. You guys are the best. Thank you, you so much. Yes, yeah, thanks. love you. you. Love you. Love, love you. you. And oh yeah, Papa Popeye sent us this snap <laughs> today. This is <laughs> this is the best people in the world. Sawyer. So yeah. Wait, can I say Sawyer? And that's and that's Popeye. He he was birthed by Thank Mama you. Popeye and Papa <gasps> Popeye. Oh look at that good. <laughs> and boy. he was conceived in South Africa. <laughs> 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 can we I know Popeye's entire life story. You don't get these cash. Oh. You know, oh man, I'm so mad. My knees are gonna be so happy when you're done. My feet are. My feet feel so bad. Been, oh, completely soaked for the past six days of hiking. Oh, there's so many good stealth sites here. That's a that is awesome. It's not really stealth, it's on trail, but whatever. I don't want to imagine too many people are hiking around here. Popeye. To the Lake Michigan, I guess. Because once we're going, I think that's why they're calling them ponds. Because we're getting closer to. All right, y'all, we've made it to the road where our packs are getting dropped. We've done 13 miles so far today. And now we're going to get our packs and then go four more, four or five more to a shelter. And, uh, but first we're gonna cook dinner here.
because we're hungry and I need to take my wet socks off because I'm about to go crazy with the way it feels. That was so cool. I just met Skip and Donna. I think, I'm sorry, I'm so bad with names, but they're subscribers to the channel. Super awesome people from Georgia. So, uh, yeah, that was cool to meet them. And uh, shout out to you guys. Thank you for watching and uh, saying hi out here. But my goodness, this is a beautiful overlook. Beautiful, beautiful. There's 4,000 lakes in Maine is what I, what I think I've heard. So there's the crew getting their packs together. Hey, what's up? <laughs> So I am cooking dinner tonight. Freaking tuna. This is all of my recipe set out. Uh, yeah, we're shoving up out here. Using this as a wind blocker, it's not really working. All right, we just spent a long time at that spot eating and enjoying this beautiful view and sunset. It is six o'clock now, and the plan is to either make it to the shelter. Um, if we do that, we have an 11 mile day tomorrow. Um, if we find a cool stealth spot on the way to the shelter, because we're gonna be getting in late, we don't know if there'll be tent pads, always the problem. We already ate, so we don't really need to go there for water purposes. So, if we find a cool stealth site, we'll be doing like 13 or 14 tomorrow, which is uh, on our plan to get to Stratton on Friday. So, we're gonna see what we can find up ahead. And I will let y'all know, look at all these cool stickers right here but yeah this has been an awesome spot to chill and there's the trail got more climbing more climbing but now I've got 30 pounds on my back because we have a way too much food per usual We just climbed over, can't really see, but the sun, beautiful sunset. And then down there, you can kind of see in the frame, there's a reflection and that's a pond. And it is absolutely gorgeous. It feels so good. It is supposed to get down to 35 degrees tonight, <laughs> um, but I've got my 20 degree sleeping bag and a silk liner and all my winter gear, so it'll be all right. Good morning, everybody. Last night we did a little bit of night hiking to the Long Pond. We stealth camped by this pond, and we, yeah, our, our tent sites are back there. We're gonna have some bagels for <laughs> breakfast. <laughs> with the view. With with the view. We just need the sun to come over here. It's going to be a long time before that happens. Yeah, probably so. Alright, along with the bagel, I'm having a little smoothie. Banana, mango, orange, baby food. 100 calories. Not bad. Let's see how this one is. Mm -hmm. We're just watching this big cloud come straight towards us. The waves have picked up. And uh, yeah, we're screwed. Cool. Good morning.
10 minutes later. Oh, we are getting surrounded. It's cold. Moved back to the tent to drink the coffee since the clouds were rolling through. Oops. Dude, please don't. <laughs> Well, he, he's just walking. Please move. I don't want him to attack me. Uh, supposedly there's some evil grouse that attacks hikers around here. This might be him. Okay. Well, you better get it on video. Well, I'm videoing now. Go away. You're videoing now? On my GoPro. Oh! Okay. Hopefully he doesn't attack me. All right, child. Well, I need to let you go. I I could cook him. I bet I could eat him. Yeah. Oh, I've been seeing um meese tracks. We decided that the plural of moose is meese. <laughs> okay. Yep. Oh my goodness, it was so nice to just walk in the woods and not be. Rock climbing for once. Just walking. It's a beautiful day. Absolutely gorgeous day. Perfect weather. In my opinion for hiking. It's like, last time I checked it was 48, 50. My favorite hiking weather. That's about what it stays in Arkansas pretty consistently in the winter. So that's why a lot of my backpacking trips and stuff and hiking trips in Arkansas. I do in the weather, win, winter, and I'm happiest when I can wear my Carhartt beanie and a sweatshirt and not get too hot when hiking. Um, so, a little rundown of today. The first 11 miles are super easy, very um, easy terrain, like so. And then we hit the Saddleback Mountains, and there's three peaks. And two of them are above tree line. So if we commit to that, then we are committing to, we're either doing 11 or like 17 because once you pass that 11, then you're above tree line and you're kind of having to, to go, go that distance. So you're not putting yourself in danger. It is gonna rain later today. So we'll see, you know, how bad that gets, that might make the decision for us. We'll just see how that goes, but um, yeah, so far, so good this morning. You can canoe here. Yay. All right, we stopped at that pond for a while. There's canoes there that you can take out. We didn't do that because it started raining. Like it is raining now. Stopped and ate something. Now we're back on the road. We have a couple options today. There's five, it's five more miles to the road. We could possibly get a hitch into Rangley. That make it like a 10 mile day, which is 
pretty much what we need to do. Oh, because the other plan today was to do 11. I mean, going into town always sounds like a good idea because food. Ah, I don't know. I don't know what the right call is. Uh, so we'll just walk on it. I gotta get water though, so that's the next order of business is find the stream. Shout out to the main people for building this beautiful trail. This is awesome. Main care. Oh, I just walked in your... All right, decisions have been made. I called my dad and got his expert opinion and we are going to go ahead and go into town tonight. Oh my goodness, look at this view. Wow, this is awesome. You even have a nice little sitting rock right there. That is beautiful. Hold on, I'm gonna take a picture of this. Benefit of going in town is one, we get food. Two, I need to charge all my devices at the last place, the cabin. Um, I never got my charging block completely charged up. So um, if I stay two more days out in the woods, I will not be able to video for y'all or have a phone or anything. So that's kind of important. I already called a shuttle. Her name's Kim and she, we're gonna schedule for her to pick us up early in the morning so we can get an early start. Wrangley just seems like a pretty cool town. Most of my friends that are out here hiking on the trail have stopped into Wrangley and stayed a couple nights. So there's a cool little restaurant and brewery that we're planning on stopping by. Um, oh, 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 it's very, very slick right here. Dear miss. And it started raining again. So I'm like 1.3 from the road. Kim is gonna come pick us up, take us into town, we'll get checked in, and yeah, get a good night's rest. Just what the doctor ordered, and then that puts us 32 miles from Stratton, so yay. We just got a shuttle with Miss Kim, and we're at the IGA. We had to stop to get cash, and we're doing like a lead to tiny reset bag. Or you can go on a plane ride. Oh, I don't want to do that. <laughs> they write canoes, kayaks, boats. Oh, oh look at the plane. Yeah. It's usually That's, more than oh, one. Oh, that would be so do. cool. Yeah, I was so thrilled at them hikers. They told me the whole story. I'm like, oh. thank you so much. You're very welcome. <laughs> look at all the pugs. <laughs> hey. We have one more, too. We have four pugs. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, that one's teeth. so fat. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> look at him taking his tongue out. He's Gero. like, hey. Yeah. Called your dog fat. Oh, she is fat. <laughs> <laughs> I can't argue that. Aww. I gotta get her out and exercise. <laughs> <laughs> we can take him hiking with me. Yeah, I know, exactly. He's been taking all our time and energy. And yeah, she, I bet. So she's just been sitting there, like, watching it all go on. <laughs> all right, this is our, we stayed at, um, main town and lake or something Langley town and lake and this is our room we have a little back porch here with right on the lake so <laughs> everybody loves that we're hikers we got a room and i got the room with the bathtub and I'm taking a freaking bath tonight for the first time since Atkins, Virginia. I haven't taken a bath in months. I'm so excited. Oh yeah, we're about to get food. Best decision ever. <laughs> <laughs> Getting a lobster roll, winning mid, fries, and pizza, yeah. 